Hello friends, this is Guruja and we're playing the Tale of Piston today. This game is a Persian game, um, a game inspired by a famous Persian poem uh, named Khusrev and Shirin. As a Turk, uh, I respect um, the Persian mythology and literature and I have already read um, that um, romance the, the the poet Husrev and Shirin uh, and I like uh, Persian um, poems literature like Rumi Mevlana Celaleddin Rumi a Sufi uh, poet uh, who lived in Anatolia uh, in modern Turkey uh, and the other Sufi poets uh, so, uh, and I'm interested in history and uh, especially the Middle Eastern uh, history. So, uh, I'm very curious about this game and the tale of Biston. So, let's start this game. Uh, it's a pity that this game hasn't a um, Turkish language setting, so... I have to play this game in English. Uh, yeah, and look at that crown. That's so. Uh, that's a. That's looks like. That uh, looks like. Some Persian shahs crowns. The shahs uh, are sultans and the leaders of their community. Also, a. Uh, uh, title in Turkish language the same as Persian Shah the Padishah slowly like the morning sun clambering over the horizon conscious so uh, I don't he accept his eyes I don't expect a very uh, complicated game How pleasant, he thought. But I'm happy to see nature's song. Some Persian but stuff. Something was not right. I have played a Persian the game was out of tune. Uh, before. It was about uh, it was about the coup in Iran, the Mullah regime, the Humanis. Um, rise of Khomeini and the Mullahs in Iran. I think it was something like 1979. And As another game, a cat coop, past, something like that. He breathed in the fresh mountain air. It was inspired by it Persian history. His mind. Questions bobbed to the surface, like apples in water. How did I come to be here? He asked so himself. So Persian. Persian people no, that's not have a right long question. history Nor is with where arts, I'm going. poems, literature, mythology. Crystallized in his fogged mind. I don't know who I am. Many stories they have good have art and perspective to life and nature. The paths they have trodden. But there is more to this tale. That I promise. So this game won't be a classical game in game history, but we cannot see so Soft many games of the man's lantern fell on an exotic made bird. by Persian people, Farsi people. So him. this is unique, Perhaps the bird and I like different cultures. He followed the hoopoe on instinct. Its beautiful trail fanned the flame of hope. Yeah, those stone carvings.
they look like the stone carvings in Persepolis yeah look at that so let's check out the gameplay nothing to find He spotted something glinting among the rocks. Something that called to him. What I called me. All he did was pull that hatchet out of the stone. A simple act with a remarkable outcome. The Revelations realm. There was no way back. Whatever this mysterious place was, he had to push on. The weight of the hatchets in his hands brought some comfort as he journeyed deeper. Use the hatchets to destroy the stone, so... Yeah. Who's there? The man called, his voice muffled by the thick, static air. Please. So it's an easy start. Where are you? No answer. This game is similar to he then felt despair, a game named Jotun. The kind that only the truly alone know. It was about but he the was Viking mistaken. saga. Wiki Viking mythology. Another so this game place. is inspired by Persian mythology. So that space thing is about alive, some but mythological by theme. By otherworldly rocks and glowing tentacles. The glowing tentacles. Of the man's hatchets were sharp. Find a way to set. The tree free. All right. Before that, I need to check here. So, what about the music in this game? The man didn't know if the creature were friend or foe. Zing game music inspired by Persian here, historical music too. His own. What is that tree? Is that the creature wise? Tree of life. But empathy overrode his Tree of life was an was an important figure in pagan religions. Persians believed some sh pagan religions like um, how do you call it Zoroastrianism Zardushluk in Turkish Zoroastrianism and the other interesting beliefs in history they they believed Interesting. Talk to the tree. What happened? The man cried. Where have you taken me? Calm yourself, human. Did you not want to leave that alien realm? 
the tree leaned closer and introduced himself as all seeds. All seeds. A pomegranate tree. Pomegranate tree? I, what do you mean? I don't know who I am, the man said. All seeds pondered. Others like me have been afflicted by a sickness. Help them, and I will return the favor. All seeds told the man to look for talisman stones. Strange rocks protruding from the ground. Destroying the talisman stones would free his kind. So, this then is our main objective, the destroying the talisman stones. A great branch outwards, pointing east. Unearth the Kanat Gate to find the path forward. To find yourself. I think that's a weak beginning for a game like this, but this is something like a tutorial part for this game. Just follow the um, Phoenix. Uh, it's uh, it's a mythological um, bird. Uh, its name Anka Kushu An or Anka Bird. Um, and there was a Sufi poem about that phoenix. Uh, it has some mis mysterious secret meanings um, about this bird uh, and their um, journey. So I think that's that bird, that phoenix. So what's going on? A secret door. Use the Kanat gate. Kanat. Kanat means a uh, wing, bird wing, uh, in Turkish, and with with then another another meaning uh, is about the Kanat. Uh, is um, the sides, left sides, and right sides but I think it's about the bird's wing interesting there are so many similar and even the same um, words uh, in in Turkish uh, so many Persian birds because Turks traveled across uh, uh, from east to west and they settled in uh, Persia modern uh, the man could modern roll day under low Iran with ease and we learned so many things about um, Persians uh, we, uh, we learned so many cultural things from Persian people because Turks uh, lived like nomads they were tribes Turkish tribes and they learned about culture writing religion and so many things from uh, cultured Persian people and Turks uh, have already managed um, they have lead that country I don't know what uh, what do the Persians think about that period of their history so this is not a history lesson and I'm telling events and things in Turkish history perspective so all right as he ran the man mulled all seeds words all seeds How will rescuing the tree's kin help me recover my memory he wondered So, I think I can break this, break these vases. If travel broadens the mind, I should be advised, I should be wise beyond compare. I have traversed mountains, brave jungles and trudged through deserts. But all journeys must come to an end. Perhaps Mount Biston will be the place I settle, where I build my abode. Is it suitable? After all, wisdom is knowing how little we know. 
Yeah, I think that's uh, uh, a diary entry. That's about the engraved into the um poem I have um told you before in the video. Uh, it's the journey of those birds. So many birds have traveled uh, to the highest mountain uh, known in the world. Uh, so uh, they couldn't finish this journey and they couldn't arrive. Just one uh, bird uh, could succeed it and the other um, birds uh, burned they have set in fire and this is about some Sufi perspective if you want to um, if you want to uh, reach the uh, highest uh, position in the world if you want the true meaning in the world uh, and that means uh, to know the God, the Creator, to know Him. This is an uh, Islamic uh, perspective, by the way. Uh, maybe it has changed after uh, the conver conversion to Islam. Maybe they have changed the story. I don't know. I'm not sure about it. But if you know the Creator and if you want to know the secret meaning of the life, you have to burn. You have to burn yourself. You have to suffer and the Sufis suffer in the uh, in this world uh, to know this meaning uh, it is similar to Buddhist monks and some uh, Christian um, monks so that's that's a uh, similar story something like something about Jesus Christ he suffered in this world to give people happiness all right let's go uh, sorry about my bad English by the way uh, I want to describe the things he worried about the nature of the sickness that all seeds had with some good verse was it with a good English but my English is not so good little did he know and if I had told to you these stories in Turkish, my main language, a few you don't know further. the thing, so... You are invincible to all the damage while you are rolling by pressing A. So, that's a portal. What are these goblins? Yeah, I can roll with A button. This game is somehow easy. Each diamond represents one of the trees you have freed from the sickness. This must be one of All Seed's trees. The man thought, breathing hard after his encounter. The tree had unfurled its vibrant leaves, embracing all but forgotten sunshine. What were those nasty little creatures? The man thought. Were they tainted by this sickness? Or harbingers of it. So what now? Yeah, the same enemies. That's boring, man. I just want some different enemies to fight. And maybe other attack styles. Maybe heavy attack or something like that. I just have a roll. 
and the run run button these are not enough maybe different weapons some range and melee find a new cannot gate All the trap trees are rescued in this area. Explore more to find the hidden items or find the new Kanat gate to return. As the second of all seeds kin was released, night cast its veil over the land. The inevitability of dusk, the serene quiet of it, brought the man a sense of peace. Seeds was right. There is a sickness afflicting nature. Nature. The talisman stones must be at the heart of it. But where did they come so from? So I'm. Were those swarming creatures? I'm going down. Them? So many questions. What about the writings on so the wall? So few answers. With some. And still, he didn't ancient know who he letters, was. alphabet. Is there any secret places? No. And what about the lore, the encyclopedia or something? I think if you want to uh, make a, a game inspired by mythology and poems, you need to add this game um, something like encyclopedia or codex uh, or info or help page and some uh, some informative things because people buy this game to know something more about uh, Persian mythology and poems um, and maybe to learn something new about uh, Persian culture and maybe uh, famous uh, Persian mythological characters because uh, we don't know so many uh, Persian mythological stuff uh, in game uh, industry you know that's my humble advice to dear game developers if they've watched this video An apple, maybe a forbidden apple. Apple is a uh, interesting Farad. icon. Farad. Icon in myth and religion. The mountain Farhad. Farhad, Farhad is the Persian dig. name. Farhad and Shirin were Here. lovers famous lovers in Persian mythology and uh, there was an uh, Arabic version of this Layla and Majnun or Farhad and Shirin lovers Farhad uh, Farhad uh, broke the stones in the mountains he had digged uh, the caves in the mountains to reach his lover um, something Farhad. like that the same stories we learned uh, in but literature woman? lessons in Turkey and why did she ask what she did so I'm gonna dig this mountain I remember now my ha name is Farhat yeah Such solace in something so simple as a name, but still, that is all I recall. Who was that woman? Why does she want me to dig into the mountainside? Yeah. She's Shirin. Shirin means cute in our language and. I think the same meaning in Persian language too. Um, so, so 
So what about Husrev and Shirin and Farhad and Shirin? Does she want amethystine stones? Farhad wondered. Yeah, I think in the uh, in the Europe and USA, uh, the most players don't know anything about uh, those Persian poems and Farhad romances, in the and they don't get the points. Uh, I know so many things about the literature, poem, and culture uh, in Persian history and culture and mythology but I think the Western players don't get all those points so uh, they will uh, they will say man what am I doing what is this game uh, telling to me what are all those things that's nonsense they will say but It will be more practical to add some info Help screen. Me far hard, please. Maybe in a uh, in-game uh, screen menu you can describe the things. Show yourself. Far hard called into the twinkling black. Where are you? But if he was heard, the whisper didn't say. So that's an easy action adventure game. Not an actual actually a real action. But it's a simple adventure. At least at, at the beginning. We are combining the parts of the statue and the statue in front of the far huts uh, is Shirin's statue he wondered one was of the mysterious woman in his hazy memory she who pleaded with him to come to her the other no doubt was for hard himself Yeah, in another uh, similar uh, poem, uh, the two lovers, Leila and Mejnun, this is the Arabic version uh, of this poem, uh, Mejnun goes to the desert, into, into the middle of the desert, uh, he, uh, he, he tries to find, uh, he seeks um, Leila, his lover, uh, and he gets mad, he goes crazy, um, his air grows and um, he gets tired, uh, his, uh, how, do you, how do you say that, um, his, he, he goes in the desert, he travels overwhelmed in the desert and uh, after a um, um, long and tiring journey he found his lover Layla and when he uh, saw him uh, he, uh, he realized he doesn't like uh, her anymore uh, he thinks uh, she uh, the Layla is not his real lover and he realizes uh, the real love is God's love. That's the Sufi point, and uh, the, it's the important thing about the love is um, know the God and love the God. That's the real love. Uh, love between between human beings are not the real life in this world. That's something like that. Was she the key to his past and his future? 
destroy all talisman stones. Yeah, so As the statue brought down its hatchet. The bird Anka bird shows all the way. So it's easy to find. The way you then you don't get lost in this game. So the obstacles have broken. For hard My road is open. That soon his thirst for answers will be quenched. Yeah, that's my statue. My hatchet. And what is that? What? What was that? I have no idea about this thing. The this accident. Of the fallen bell shocked Farhad. But the fallen bell. Or of some unseen creature terrified him far more. So let's go. Something sinister was watching. Return to all seas. But for Hod seemed to have one ally. So what about a boss fight? Although all seeds' motivations were shrouded in mystery, he had come once again. Yeah, this game feels me like uh, a companion of Farhat. That's a journey game. That's nice. What do you know of that place? Farhad asked all seeds. A shiver passed through the tree's branches. It is the realm of lost memories and forgotten souls. When I bit the pomegranate, Farhad Something said, like a Persian Hades. had a vision. I was engraving, sculpting. Is that what I do? Am I a sculptor? All seeds pondered. I cannot say, but memories can be hewn from stone. Consider that. More of my kind are trapped. If you can help them, perhaps I can provide answers. Farhad turned to leave, but all seeds held out a gnarled palm. Be warned, though, human. The great tree said, A fearsome monster, a deed, lurks in the Revelations realm. Bestowed Does do you mean a dev, a giant, to the mountain on which or a diva, stand. a half god? I don't know. From it, if you wish to live long enough to uncover the truth. All right, find a rock suitable for an engraving. Yeah, I think I get a point about this game. Yeah, they they are stone cravings, and look at that bird. Farhad stood back and admired the engraving. Reach the Mr. Ponds. All right, let's see the next chapter and finish the video and I think we, we get the point about this game despite uh, all seeds warning Farhad felt the seed of hope taking root in his breast yeah Although if you'd like to before him uh, take a in journey darkness, into Persian mythology and feet. poetic world you may try this Farhad game it has voice. some um, he didn't yet have all roots, the answers. Uh, he had purpose. About anyone Persian culture purpose. and poems, literature. So, uh, if you are interested in uh, all about these things, you may try this game. You'd like to play this game. Alright, thank you for watching my um, video. Um, I'm sorry about my English. Um, 
it's not good I couldn't uh, under uh, I couldn't um, I couldn't speak I couldn't um, how can I say that describe all the things that I would like to tell you uh, because my bad English my English is bad uh, but uh, you get the point uh, I think so thank you for watching the video if you like the video this video and the other ones uh, you may subscribe my channel and uh, I'd like to uh, learn what you think about this game and the Persian mythology and poems uh, if you watch this video so take good care of yourselves and see you later friends